you've come so far Guiding us to the light Inspired both Young and old You've come so With patience And mindfulness We thank you Oh men We thank you This gift that you gave us is larger than life to go ahead with confidence and smile we thank you oh minna we thank you m for mindfulness i for innovation and for newness l for loyalty a for you gave us the direction Oh Minla You boosted us with your smiles Oh Minla You've come so far Guiding us to the right We thank you Oh men love we thank you Oh men love Meena ji and Lalit ji We thank you for everything A global namaste to all of you. A good morning, a good afternoon, a very good evening to whichever part of the globe you're joining us from. A very warm welcome onto the Minna Zoom session. To all the audience of Zoom, Facebook, and social media platforms. Minna, Meena, Ben Kagram, and Lalit Soda. Started these sessions at the beginning of the pandemic in the year 2020, when the pandemic was hitting strong. We needed inspiration, we needed motivation, we needed to spread happiness, peace and love to the global community. And that's what we've been doing since April 2020. Today, Minla is truly delighted to be associated with Beyond Bollywood, one of the Dhamakedar performances that is coming up in London at the Peacock Theatre. Today, we have the writer, the producer, the director of the show, the choreographer of the show, Mr. Rajiv Goswami, a multi-talented man who is bringing this once again to the boomy of London. Ladies and gentlemen, whichever part of the globe you are joining us on, stay tuned because along with Mr. Goswami, we have a number of lead stars, a number of lead actors, and we are going to find out so much about the show. And if you haven't booked your tickets as yet, you've got to book them with Peacock Theatre. Beyond Bollywood is coming to London with a great the marker. Ladies and gents, you have to watch this show. So before we go ahead, it's a lovely, wonderful, warm afternoon in London, England. India, I believe, is full of monsoon rains. And Kenya is basking in its glory of sunshine also. So all over the world, wherever you are from, ladies and gentlemen, a very warm welcome. Let me introduce you to this wonderful, multi-talented personality, Mr. Rajiv Goswami. He has two successful Indian musical debuts in the London's West End, and as such, can be singled out as India's only theatre producer, writer, director, and choreographer. Rajiv Ji has amassed accolades spanning 25 years which includes choreography to India's first 3D animation movie, Roadside Romeo, holding the record for a four-minute one-shot Bollywood song for the movie Cash, and a choreography for over 50 Bollywood movies such as Shootout at Lokanwala, Mission Istanbul, Bhagwan, Cash, 
Roadside Romeo, Bunty and Bubbly, Dil Mange More, and more. Beyond Bollywood, the musical is his brainchild, conceived, written, produced, directed, and choreographed by none other than this awesome human being, Mr. Rajiv Goswami. He continues to receive standing ovations after 500 performances worldwide. Beyond Bollywood was showcased as the opening action at the Covent Garden at the Oliver Awards in 2015, and also featured on the BBC, the Polo Grady Show, whilst being applauded by the audience at the London Palladium on an eight week run. This success spurred the spin off of Namaste India, the musical for Dollywood Park in the United States of America, continuing to spread the appreciation of the authentic Indian folk fused with Western dance forms. Dubai Bollywood Parks is currently showcasing Indian dance performance curated by Mr. Goswami himself. Umrao Jan Ekada is another Rajiv Goswami masterpiece, ladies and gents. This was here before COVID. The ones who missed it, they can't miss be, uh, Bo Beyond Bollywood. Umrao Jan, a musical which thrilled audiences across Delhi to Mumbai to London. And in 2020, uh, Mr. Goswami's passion is theater production and he continues to revive multiple proposals for international audience in parallel to his hands-on approach of current projects. This gentleman is so multi-talented, ladies and gents. Not only is he multi-talented, but he's an awesome human being. Welcome on Mindla Zoom session, Mr. Goswami. A very warm welcome on behalf of Meena Ben and myself and the global audience. Thank you so much. Thank you so much uh, for this lovely introduction. And uh, wow, it sounds so good, you know, uh, <clears throat> and pretty exciting. Uh, thank you guys for having this session here and inviting me over. And uh, yes, uh, I am just uh, overwhelmed by the response that I'm getting already on social media and uh, people like you are helping us supporting this, uh, uh, you know, musical Beyond Bollywood which we have again, one, once again, bring into London. So yeah, hoping for the best and hoping for all the love from all the Londoners. Well, you're going to get a lot of love from us Londoners, I must tell you that. Before we move ahead, Rajiv Ji, we have Meena Ben, who is currently based in Nakuru, the Flamingo city of Kenya. And she is going to kick off this session with a traditional welcome to yourself on our Zoom. Meena Ben, the floor is all yours if you want Namaste, to unmute. Meena ben. Namaste. <laughs> Desi Krishna. Desi Krishna. Desi Krishna. That's for you. Thank you. That, Thank yeah. you so much. Yeah. And this. Thank you. And this is special Malaji for you. From the Ross. Wow. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And welcome. So mm. now I'm going to say Jambo. Good Jambo. morning, good afternoon, and good evening, wherever you are logging. <laughs> my cute cousin Lalit and myself are super excited to welcome you all to our Minla Zoom and those who have joined live on Facebook. Welcome, Goswani Rajivji and Bollywood team. Welcome to the Flamingo and crater city of Nakuru, where Lake Nakuru is famous for wildlife and flamingos. We have oldest museum, old volcanic crater, now most famous for East African Safari Rally. Nakuru County is the one where world famous fastest runners in the world like Eliud and Kipchoge Kiano are born. We have first Kenyan, James, who climbed Mount Everest last month. First Kenyan daughter, Angelina, to take part to win ladies double tennis in Wimbledon. Wow. World Safari Lady is right here in Nakuru. 
and we have winners also. We are number one, Africa. Well, it's a beautiful nation. Mewe and Dwana. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce to our backbone of this session, Dr. Lalit Soda. Dr. Lalit Soda is chiropractor, world-class speaker, and author, and very soon he's going to be the actor. <laughs> In giving back to the society, recently he has climbed Himalayas. Lalit, we are very proud of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. He's also recipient of many awards, including Marwa Journalist Award and World Lohana Mahajan Parishad Journalist Award recently been awarded only two to five people in all of London, in world. Thank you. Over to you, Lali. Thank you very much, Meena Ben. I really appreciate that. Meena Ben is so passionate about her city of Nakuru, Rajivji, and yes. that hence the passion comes out, as you can see. She has all the reasons to be. She has absolutely, all the absolutely. So very, very, very warm welcome to you, my, my dear friend, uh, my, my humble uh, uh, pronouns to you. And here we go with our first question, Rajivji. Yeah. My very first question to you is, this beyond Bollywood is just shaking everybody here. It's creating a bit of a volcanic damakas over here. Yeah. How did this name beyond Bollywood come about? Uh, <clears throat> uh, well, as you know, that I've been in the industry, uh, in the entertainment field, started off as a dancer, then assisting and choreographing and now directing. Uh, so, uh, fortunately, uh, my work takes me places. I get to travel to different places. And uh, the best part that happened about this traveling is that I came across the international theater, musicals. So, when I used to go to US, I used to watch Broadway. When I come to London, of course, West End. So, and somehow this art has really attracted me over the years. And I've always been wanting to uh, do something out of the box, something which is of that creative skill. Uh, I always wanted to be a part of or create something like that. And uh, since my <clears throat> schooling has been Bollywood, <laughs> I've been working in Bollywood since quite some time from live shows uh, to choreography in films, working with different actors. Uh, somehow I, I felt a void of, you know, uh, projection of uh, the authentic Indian culture and the roots uh, that we have, like our culture goes, uh, you know, the dance forms and the music, it goes uh, like ages back, centuries back. And we, we, are, we are so wealthy with this art form. So somehow I felt that maybe, you know, uh, if I, I could create something, uh, which, which, which truly expresses the authenticity and our heritage of music and dance and uh, this culture and this tradition. So uh, hence I had to go beyond Bollywood. And so uh, it was a very obvious thing that I had to name it a very, uh, I wanted a very realistic title. So this is what it is, it's beyond Bollywood. Well, it certainly is. Oh my God, if anybody has to, or has seen the previous performances that you have brought to London or all over the world, my God, Umrao Jan was out of this world, a spectacular, lavish with costumes, absolutely toe-tapping dances, music, everything was just out of this world. And you're right, when you're sitting there, you actually now, if I think back, it was beyond Bollywood. It just wasn't Bollywood. It was way beyond Bollywood. So now I understand why you named it Beyond Bollywood. So this idea, as you said, uh, came to you while you were traveling and everything. But the very first time you thought Bollywood is for you or this is the industry you want to get in, what were you going through? What was going in your mind were you training for it? Were you born with this talent? Tell us, tell us a little bit more about where this creative choreography, writing, producing, directing came from. Is it something you're born with 
Is it something that you learned as you went along? Uh, I think a, a bit of both. I wouldn't know if I was born with it, but I definitely felt that I, over the years, uh, experience, I can say. Like, I, I obviously started as a very passionate dancer. You know, dancing was not even a profession, a uh, legit profession, I think, uh, in back in the 90s at that time. Or maybe it was, but I wasn't aware of it. Uh, we, we were busy dancing in like you know family functions and birthday parties and I was tired of it I said no, I want to I want to grow I want to evolve and hence you know I and there was there were not too many schools uh, you know, dance schools in in Mumbai or I didn't have access to them so I think and fortunately from my college days from my college competitions I started uh, to participate and fortunately I got appreciated for what I used to do and I just kept on following my instincts and uh, whatever came my way and whatever helped me evolve this art form, uh, develop this art form, grow, learn. I love learning at any stage of time, you never stop learning. So I just continued, I just went with the flow <clears throat> and uh, of course, uh, I, I, would, I would thank uh, a lot of people on my way, along my way uh, in the entertainment field who believed in me, who trusted me with uh, my skill set of being a dancer. And yeah, and then slowly, slowly, I started developing a lot of interest in, you know, the creation part of it, because that is very adventurous. And I love adventure. So uh, not only through dancing, but also I thought that there are other things which are required to grow as an artist. Uh, so I didn't want to stop myself from just being a dancer, but I just also wanted to learn the art to create something magical, to create something uh, which people appreciate, which gives pleasure to people, which entertains people, which makes them laugh, which make them cry, express. So hence I uh, started learning and growing and on my journey. And this is the outcome eventually <laughs> of uh, what I have learned over the years, I can say. Okay, so I have a question a little bit going back in your life. So after mommy, papa, aapka jab janam hua tha, tab wo aapki janam kundli leke kidar gaye the astrologer ke paas? In fact, I belong to a very uh, uh, high profile uh, religious preacher, Shri Vallabha, Shrimad Vallabhacharya Ji, uh, Jagat Guru Shrimad Vallabhacharya Ji. I am his descendant, 17th generation, and uh, I belong to a family of very well learned uh, people and uh, bhajans have grown up in bhajans and kirtans and you know uh, religious and spiritual lectures so our family is quite inclined towards uh, spirituality yes. and i was uh, i am the odd one i guess uh, it's not that i'm not spiritual but um, i did not uh, i wanted to explore more i did not and i wanted to uh, blend uh, my spirituality uh, with uh, something which is more creative uh, in a different field and uh, yeah so I have to explore I am I am an adventurous guy so I just didn't stop to that and but, and, and, <clears throat> and if uh, if you're sharing a very true motivational message from the bottom of your heart I picked up on a few things you said you're very adventurous you were not going to stop. You go, you're a go-getter. You wanted to explore, investigate, and bottom line, succeed in this mission that you have. Is that correct? Yeah. I, I, I feel just being in here and you know, experiencing this and being able to do what I'm doing itself, I think, is a success. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Mega success. How many I mean, this uh, or get this opportunity in life? where uh, you have your spirituality intact and you uh, you can do what you like and you try and change things around you and create something which is unique uh, and yet stick to your basics so uh, very few people get to do that and i'm happy that i'm the lucky one you are the chosen one <laughs>
<laughs> you know, maybe a lucky one, I can say at least. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So again, um, going back to your first break into Bollywood, when and how did that happen? Uh, break into Bollywood, uh, as in, yeah, I, I started getting professional shows. I was chosen from, uh, uh, by winning a dance competition, intercollegiate dance competition. So the judges are professional choreographers. They kind of like my dancing. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, I was raw, I need to be trained. And uh, yeah, eventually I got my first break uh, on a live show. I worked with big choreographers in the industry uh, as a dancer, as an assistant, and then I, I got an opportunity to work with uh, the biggest of the actors as a choreographer. And uh, yeah, so the journey went on uh, from, from live stage to films and back to live stage. <laughs> That's interesting how you've gone back and forth, but, but really, really excelled at this theatrical musicals that you have been creating for the audiences all over the world. So one more question. You just said you went from uh, dancing to directing to choreography. So my question to you is, do we get to see a few of those uh, foot tapping moves of yours on stage in Beyond Bollywood? Uh, no, uh, I, right now my focus is more on uh, direction and choreography, but uh, I can promise that uh, what my actors and my dancers and my cast and crew will deliver, it's going to be really breathtaking. I can promise that. That was actually you leading into my next question. Uh, so we don't get to see on the stage except at the end coming as the choreographer, co uh, producer, director, correct? Uh, uh, I, I'm not sure I'm, uh, I like people to uh, uh, get the credit for the work because it's not easy to perform on stage and dance and it's, it's, it's a, a one man's madness that everybody is busy executing on stage. So it's very difficult to ex uh, execute someone else's vision with that same amount of zeal and perfection and my actors and my crew are doing it. So definitely they are the ones who I believe should take the walk on stage and take the bow and people should give them a standing ovation. But it's very wonderful. There's yes. no doubt about it. But yeah. the face behind the show, the zeal behind the show, the yeah. passion behind the show. We need to see you on stage at least. Yeah, I do come sometimes on stage. Uh, it's a great feeling to be a part of, you know, to lead this kind of an ensemble. And, you know, when people have loved it, you get all the kind of cheering and applauding. And, you know, so it's a very proud feeling uh, when you walk on stage with your cast and crew, because it's not a one person's job, definitely. My yes. vision. Uh, yes. My vision is nothing if uh, my cast and crew do not perform and do not deliver what I have in mind. So they have a bigger responsibility is what uh, I feel, you know, and the way they do it. So they definitely deserve uh, a round of applause, I can say. And we can give them that right from here. But my question once again is you have brought your team and you have made them work with you. You have told them your vision. And they are the ones who are projecting the vision on stage for us. Now for that, it's not an easy task at all. Hmm. How do you manage to get everybody to follow your vision, to make sure that they are projecting it and that you are satisfied that when you walk on stage and say, hey, this is my mission projected to the audience. How do you get that through to them? Um, Honestly, uh, like uh, there are different, you have to, you have to be very sure about your vision. Uh, right. If I am certain about it, the kind of readings that I have done and I give them different examples also, like, you know, sometimes I uh, take examples from Stanislavski or Meisner or, you know, we know these kind of names. Uh, so I, uh, I, and they also refer to these kinds nowadays, you know, everything is uh, uh, very open on the internet 
and people are educating themselves. So it kind of, you know, makes our lives easy. But yes, I have to be very clear in my vision and my perception and what I want. If I have that clarity, uh, I think I'm able to give my actors and my cast and my crew, my technicians, uh, absolute clarity. And uh, yeah, and they are, they are like, we have a lot of talent in India, in our country, you know, who are uh, self-taught also and self-trained, self-taught. And uh, they really put in a lot of hard work to get things right. So yeah, I mean, it's both ways, I can say. Of course, you share your vision with them. They share your vision. They yes. own your vision. That's why they're able to project it so well. Yes. But you know what? As you know, managing a team, managing yourself is easy. Managing your team, especially when it's people, because people have different thoughts, different uh, wishes, different ideas, but you make them work with your ideas. So you are obviously a very strong leader, if I may say that. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. So I want you to share yeah. a couple of your qualities as a leader. How do you engage your team to work with you and share your vision? Uh, the first and foremost thing when we audition people, uh, after the auditions and after I, I, I we like people uh, who are uh, talented enough to execute this skill, when we see their potentials, uh, after that, this is a very important thing that uh, since uh, theater, uh, theater is an art of passion. And uh, so what I see in my actors or in fact in the entire team, even technicians, uh, backstage management crew, everybody, uh, I see one thing which has to be common in everybody, which is how passionate they are about what they're doing because if they lack passion then it becomes very mechanical and uh it uh, it doesn't serve the purpose i feel so the one thing that i see in all my cast and crew is how passionate they are how honest they are towards this this particular art form uh it's not only about you know coming okay i'm a dancer uh, um, okay what's the payment like well, how many days rehearsals and okay fine when when do i get my payments okay i get to travel here what do i eat uh those things are separate what is your intention to be a part of beyond bollywood it just doesn't take talent it also takes passion absolutely thank you for sharing that big word passion and i think when everybody has a passion that's how strong the team is Okay, so moving on slightly on a different angle, we've talked a little bit about your uh, your life. You've told us a little bit about your background. You've told us about your passion about Beyond Bollywood. Well, how would you tell us this to this global audience that's currently on Facebook, on Zoom, on other social media platforms as this will be shared to? What is it so special about Beyond Bollywood? Uh... Uh, I can, uh, I would like to put it this way. Uh, yeah. Like uh, when, when I used to travel around, uh, I used to see a lot of these musicals where I used to see, like the world knows about Shakespeare plays and uh, they know Petrarch back in 12th century, Dante, the Comedia, uh, Divine Comedia, then uh, Bogaccio. So all these names are very big in this field and people see there are a lot of work. There have been a lot of definition. Stanislavski wrote a book on acting in drama. But what I realized since I come from a particular background where you know uh, they read a lot, Shastra, Puran, Ved. So like we come, like I come across a book which says, uh, Natya Shastra of Bharat Muni, which goes ages and centuries back, you know, right from the times of, uh, you know, where Veda Shastra Puran came into existence, right? So this is our heritage, like how Bharat Muni in the Natya Shastra mentions Vibhav Anubhav Vibhichari Sanyogat Ras Nishpatti. 
that means an actor vibhav means actor anubhav means action vivichari means emotions sanyogat means getting together ras nishpatti produce emotions in in the audience so when all these things get together they produce an emotion which the audience feels so this sutra you know this scripture has been there since the time since the time has started ages when shastra ved quran came into existence they appeared it is that far it is that deep that back so i feel that we need to hold this like you know so we also should be the flag bearer of this art form and there is a lot of depth in our art form in our culture in the dance in the music in acting drama so i feel that when uh, this is beyond bollywood is just an attempt just to start uh, to showcase the wealth just a part just a trailer to showcase the wealth of this art form that india has so and i want this to be on a global platform i want to take this to like the world places especially broadway absolutely in fact uh, you 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 uh, clued me into a couple of my questions that i want to actually ask you to um so obviously this beyond bollywood concept what you are bringing to us is just thoda sa swad of yeah. our heritage that we have this is a trailer so we have big things to come so what is your vision that was my question i was also going to ask you aap ye bol rahe hai ki ye to ye sirf ek taster session hai ye trailer hai to aage kya karna hai aapko yahi this is the vision yahi mujhe aage karna hai ki i want to take this art form i want to create a lot of these musicals like um there is kalidas kalidas has created the mahakavya there is kadambari is these are great writings so i i believe that i want to keep creating these kind of combinations these these you know beautiful story lines or these beautiful uh, piece of art on live on stage with dance music and drama and uh, i i am sure that people will get engaged eventually they will get used to uh, the way they watch a lion king or uh, a week you know or a hamlet or a hamilton so they will also be attracted towards this uh, these uh, scriptures this literature on stage this is my vision absolutely there is such a powerful vision and i'm sure as you said if your vision is clear there is clarity in it yeah. you will achieve it with a good team Thank because you. i will say one thing the big vision and the success of umrao jan my god you guys rocked sadler's well theater <laughs> you guys were just booming there house full at every show because if that's the test that people have had last before covid well ladies and gents this is even thoda masaledar session coming in beyond bollywood is going to be an extravagant dance routine you will see the tap of the foot and you will be thinking my goodness i want to go on stage and dance with this performers hilarious one liners i believe is that correct there's some good cracking jokes in there yeah there are there are nice jokes also but it's a and uh, and and various various different folk dances that are coming up too is that correct kathak kathak is a form of dance kathak is coming up and i believe one of the the stars is going to be the lead uh, one of the actresses Uh, Pooja Pant, she is one of the Kathak specialists, a very good graduate in Kathak dancing. Is she is going to be participating in this Beyond Bollywood? Is that correct? Yes, yes, very much. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So, yeah. In fact, that actually leads to my next question. You know, you got this wonderful star cast with Umrao Jan, lovely people who you've seen on TV, some amazing choreographers, dancers themselves. and beyond bollywood has some very very superstars that are coming on board how do you select these guys do you sit on the selection committee do they come and give you an audition and what do you look in these guys when they're coming to you so share that with us because i bet you the people listening on facebook and social media they're thinking 
I want to get into Beyond Bollywood next time Mr. Goswami is airing it. How do we get to you? Uh, yeah, like we we call for auditions. So uh, we uh, like on social media nowadays is the easiest way to uh, reach out to people. So uh, we have open auditions for uh, and, and dancers. And uh, they all come from uh, auditions. And then, yes, we all sit together and watch those auditions, each and every audition tape. And uh, we, we, we see the style, the skill set of uh, every individual, which is required for our play. And uh, eventually, yes, uh, we select and then I interview them. I talk to them personally, whoever is selected. So as I said before that, I just know, don't need a skill, but I also need the drive, the passion, the honesty. Uh, only then you can be a part of Beyond Bollywood. The drive, the passion, the drive, the passion, the honesty, the talent, everything. Pura masala dal ke aap ek vyakti ko select karte hai. Pura masala chahiye, kuch kam nahi hona chahiye. Because audience ko bhi pura masala chahiye, kuch kam nahi ho sakta. Or London ki audience ko to masala ke saath upar se thoda or masala chahiye, jaysay aap pani puri ke saath ek extra pani puri maangte ho, nahi bel puri ke saath. एक एक्स्ट्रा पूरी जैसे मांगते हो ऑडियंस भी ऐसा करते हैं कि पूरा खाके भी और एक पूरी दे दो हमको बिल्कुल बिल्कुल ऑडियंस को भी यही चाहिए हम बैठे हैं ना यहाँ पर बिल्कुल बिल्कुल और अभी आई वाज गोइंग टू जस्ट सेव वन थिंग टू यू अ लिटिल बिट ऑफ अ सरप्राइज फॉर यू वन ऑफ द जेंटलमैन मीन and is going to share if we can spotlight him now that would be good and if he's still logged in Mina Ben is nodding her head so she's on her way doing that Ali if we can get him on board uh, this is a little surprise for our Mr. Rajiv Goswami there we go spotlight him please Mina Ben Are Baba Harish Ji Harish oh. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Mal wow Man, I was Uh, मैं राजीव सर की बातें सुन रहा था राजीव सर ने बोला कि ये सब क्वालिटीज होना चाहिए एक सिंगर में या एक परफॉर्मर में बट मैं एक बात और ऐड करना चाहूंगा कि राजीव सर इज सच अमेजिंग पर्सनालिटी जो कि ग्रूम uh, करते हैं आपको अगर जो भी आगे सिलेक्ट होने वाले आने वाले uh, <laughs> जो भी चीजें आने वाली है सो यू विल गेट अमेजिंग टीचर एंड अमेजिंग मेंटर और मेरे साथ राजीव सर आई वांट टू थैंक यू फ्रॉम दिस जूम सेशन मीना जी और ललित सर तो काफी तारीफ कर चुके हैं लेकिन मैं बस एक ही मिनट में ये कहना चाहूंगा कि मैंने जो अपनी लाइफ में अगर उमराव जान नहीं किया होता तो शायद एक बहुत बड़ी लर्निंग मिस हो जाती तो बहुत शुक्रिया आपका नवाब नवाब साहब लंदन में नवाब साहब परफॉर्म किया है और बहुत टैलेंटेड आर्टिस्ट हैं इज अमेजिंग सिंगर इज अ वेरी वेरी जेंटल वेरी नाइस ह्यूमन बीइंग एंड इज वेरी पायस सोल इज वेरी स्पिरिचुअल हिमसेल्फ इज व्हाट आई नो ऑफ हिम एब्सोल्युटली राजीव जी ए सुपर्ब जेंटलमैन हु केम ऑन आवर Zoom सेशन अ फ्यू मंथ्स अगो and inspired us with his singing as as a singer on one of the music shows on a tv channel he was a finalist he did very very well and currently singing such wonderful bhajans for the brahma kumaris and for that om shanti to you harish ji i just want to add a few lines right now i am sitting in hyderabad this is a beautiful uh, premises here aur unhone hi mere liye zoom session arrange karke diya so thank you यहाँ के लिए एंड आई थिंक देर सो मेनी पीपल दे वॉन्ट टू कनेक्ट विथ यू तो बस मैं इतना ही कहना चाहूंगा आखिरी में सबसे पहले तो मीना जी और ललित जी आपका शुक्रिया एंड राजीव सर आपका तो दिल से शुक्रिया कभी फिर जिंदगी में आपके साथ काम करने का मौका मिला तो बहुत जल्दी Thank you, Shukriya. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much, Mr. Moyal. Ladies and gents, Mr. Harish Moyal, who actually a cast of Umrao Jan when it was playing in London. Nawab ji, aapko salam. Thank you. Thank you very much for coming on board, Rajiv ji. That was a little surprise for you. 
That was quite a surprise. That was quite a surprise. Definitely. Who is the lovely one? Yes, 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 yes. Yes. So my next question to you, Rajiv Ji, I hope you're not getting tired with all these questions coming up. I'm firing them to you. No, not at all. Not at all. Okay. So Beyond Bollywood comes to London. Yes. At the Peacock Theatre. Yes. And I urge all the audience who's listening to us, tell their friends, tell your family to buy those tickets because we want to create a Dhamaka at Peacock yes. Theatre. Absolutely. Yeah. Now, this is a show in London. Are there any plans of you taking this particular Beyond Bollywood to Europe at all? Definitely. We want to, we want to do a season in Europe. We want to take this again to the world because there are many people who must see the show. Uh, uh, I think uh, the show deserves uh, a bigger audience, definitely, worldwide. Uh, we've already done one tour in Europe and it was quite successful. We've traveled around uh, Dubai, Middle East, we've done this. Uh, so Beyond has traveled, uh, but it has more in store. I'm sure people are going to love it again and we're going to get the same love and same respect the way we got back in uh, 2015 at the London Palladium. So, you have a message for the audience. You have a message for the audience. We have to see this beyond Bollywood. But you have to see this message for the audience. We have to see this message for the audience. So, we have to see this message for the audience. In Hindi, we have to see this message in English. Don't know. Say it in Hindi and then in English, no problem. बियोंड बॉलीवुड आपको देखना चाहिए क्योंकि बियोंड बॉलीवुड जो है वो आप संस्कृति से जुड़ा हुआ है आपको ये फिर से अगर आप इंडिया पैंडेमिक की वजह से भी बहुत लोग नहीं आ पाए हैं इंडिया तो ये आपको फिर से अपने गांव अपने देश अपने अपनी जगह पर ये ले जाएगा और मैं दावा करता हूँ कि अगर आप बियोंड मतलब झूमने का, नाचने का, गाने का, सीटी बजाने का मन करेगा और ये एक धमाल डेफिनेटली होगा क्योंकि हम आ रहे हैं आपको न सिर्फ ये शो दिखाने पर हम आ रहे हैं आपको नचाने, गवाने, सीटी बजाने, मजे कराने। Thank you, thank you so much. This is I I can tell you one thing. I've seen a few clips of this. This is yeah. such a hilarious show. This is an interesting <laughs> entertainment, vibrant, colorful, yes. intoxicating with ter terrific Indian dancing, music, and the Makedar steps. I have seen Umrao Jan, the energy some of those stars had, like Sushant had. My goodness, you know, there is so much. Uh, absorbed by the audience and the ad audience is jumping on their chairs and wanting to have fun. So Beyond Bollywood is going to create another huge Damaka in London. Ladies and gents, Peacock Theatre is the place where you want to be. I booked my tickets for the 27th of August. Guys, one of the best days to do it. It's a long weekend in August. One best thing to do is go and rock Peacock Theatre. <laughs> Rajiv Ji, I have one more request to you. I know you have some of the stars lined up with you over there. Yes. But before we get into the stars, I want to ask you a personal question. Yes. Yes. If you have there, Alexandra, then we will call them next. If they are going to come with me, that would be great too. Um, would, in fact, we were all here, so we will come with me. And everybody is also excited. They know about this. So we will be dancing and then so everybody is also excited. They know about this. So we were dancing and then so everybody is like all upbeat right now and Perfect. ready for this interview. So my question to you is, so I know you are. हाँ, मेरा आखिरी question आपके साथ है, फिर थोड़े questions आगे बात करेंगे. लेकिन I know one thing, Baba, you are a fitness fanatic. हाँ हाँ. हर रोज gym जाके इतने muscles बनाते हो आप? नहीं रोज तो gym नहीं जा पाता हूँ, but Yes, uh, uh, because of my profession. Uh, thank again. I would thanks. Uh, I would thank my profession that you know it has kept me in shape and because I have to dance and choreograph and stuff. So 
वो फिटनेस हो ही जाती है और थोड़ा बहुत समय मिलता है तो थोड़ा जिम में चले जाते हैं बट मेनली इट्स डांसिंग इज गुड इनफ फॉर मी टू बी इन शेप और यू नो कीप फिट सो आपने कीप फिट बोला आपने शेप बोला शेप आपने दो बार यूज किया इस कन्वर्सेशन में सो माई क्वेश्चन इज क्या आपका अभी सिक्स पैक है या फैमिली पैक है फ्लैट स्टॉक है सिक्स पैक्स नहीं है अभी तो बट जब चाहे आ जाता है बिकॉज बिकॉज आप जो भी बोलेंगे विल होल्ड यू हॉस्टेज टू इट या सिक्स पैक है या फैमिली पैक है सिक्स पैक ओके तो दिखाओ ये टाइम मेरे एक्ट्रेस को दिखाने का है थैंक यू सो मच इट्स बीन सच अ वंडरफुल टाइम हैविंग अ चैट विद यू अ कन्वर्सेशन विद यू या यू एंड माय एक्टर्स आर हियर एवरीबॉडी कम 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 गेट इन गेट इन गेट इन आई हैव सम वंडरफुल स्टोरीज अबाउट दिस लवली स्टार्स दैट यू हैव हाय हाय गाइस ओह माय गॉड लुक एट ऑल ऑफ देम Oh, lovely blue T-shirts beyond Bollywood, guys. I want a T-shirt, yeah. Yes. Yes, of course. Yeah, yeah. We'll bring one for you. Size small. I'm not Rajiv Ji's muscular man, yeah. I'm a small guy. <laughs> <size. laughs> yeah, we're just trying to fit in. Yeah, yeah we're just trying to fit in. Everybody. Oh, पीछे आपका नटखट वो वो डिंगली बैठा है क्या है उनका नाम? कौन? डिंगली. Dingli, Dingli. Oh, Namaste. Yes, so, Ham Ji. So, I have the character's name. So, introduce yourself, Shelly. Hi, I'm Shelly. I'm Raga. I'm Emma. I'm playing various characters. <laughs> I'm playing Justin the Shelly's mom. Pooja, of course. I am Sudeep. I'm playing Ballu. Acha, acha. Ab sabka naam bhi aa gaya. Thank you for introducing. I have a very first. a uh, star that i'm going to introduce and this is the lovely alexandra villan maradis alexandra i'm going to imitate you a little bit here hello <laughs> alexandra how are you this morning is everything fine sorry 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 alexandra sorry <laughs> am i imitating you yes yes there's one more thing one more thing lali ji बोलो बोलो स्लीप वेल टुडे दे आर वेरी गुड एट इमिटेशन ओके अलेक्जेंड्रा एज शेली शेली इज टेकिंग द रोल ऑन बियॉन्ड बॉलीवुड शेली टेल अस योर स्पैनिश आयरिश बॉलीवुड ये मसालेदार परफॉर्मेंस दैट यू आर डूइंग विद योर कैरेक्टर दिस ब्लेंड ऑफ स्पाइस फ्रॉम स्पेन एंड आयरलैंड इन बॉलीवुड हाउ डिड यू कम अबाउट डूइंग दिस इन बॉलीवुड It came to me at a time that I did not expect. So I I heard about the auditions for this show, and I thought, why not give it a try? I've been in Bollywood for the last two years, um, but I've never done a show like this before. So I auditioned, and very grateful for Rajiv sir for giving me this um, opportunity to perform, especially in London. That's my hometown. So for me, it's going to be amazing. I grew up in London. being spanish but i grew up in london so for me it's a huge opportunity to bring bollywood and india indian culture to uh, my hometown which i'm super excited to do <laughs> wonderful 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 how long have you had a chance to work with rajiv ji this is your first show with him yes so we started rehearsals beginning of june mm-hmm. however we've been in the process since april may time yeah. so So and she is she has passed that whole grilling session the yes. the test that the test. i i explained to you all the questions what i am, what I am looking for in an actor yes yes wonderful yes. now now rajiv ji rajiv ji please keep your hands folded don't move them okay <laughs> don't move them alexandra what is the not so good quality about rajiv ji say is he strict with you <laughs> I don't know what to answer that. Don't move your hand. <laughs> you can, you can. You were just saying something outside. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah. Behind backstage, you were telling Soham something about Rajiv Ji. Tell us about it now. Yeah, I, I heard that. Yeah, yeah. I heard it. No. <laughs> <laughs> Rajiv Ji, after <laughs> 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 you. Rajiv Ji. 
आपके पीछे खिचड़ी पक रही है वो मुझे प्रॉब्लम नहीं है आगे अच्छी सर्व होना चाहिए टेल एस वन थिंग वाई should we come and watch you dance tell us something that's going to attract us to come to see you i think you're going to be attracted to all the incredible different styles that we're going to bring to stage i don't think there's a show like this that incorporates everything not only indian culture and style also you'll have western you'll have contemporary you'll have jazz you'll have hip hop you'll have even bollywood even though we're going be on bollywood you'll see some bollywood there you'll have a bit of everything so i think it's going to be an amazing experience for all the audience wherever you're from even if you're not indian you will love this show okay so we are sending this to ireland we are sending this to spain we're going to share it all over the world so all the irish community the spanish community has to come and watch beyond bollywood will you will you do that for us of yes, course yes, definitely i've already spread the word don't worry my mom has especially spread the word around all spain also un dos tres <laughs> un dos tres yeah. Yeah. Everyone. everyone well i must share one thing with you one thing with you alexandra your irish famous tap dancer mr michael flatley uh, yes wow one of my very very good patients and he doesn't mind me saying that wow i didn't know that Well, how are you do? Tell him to come watch the show. My God, exactly. Yes. I will message him for sure. And he doesn't mind me saying this online because I know certain people want to keep their private lives private, but he's very open about it. He uses chiropractic for his tap dancing, and I've had the greatest privilege to be treating him not once, not twice, five times. Wow, amazing. Yes. So great. So we are looking forward, Alexandra. I am certainly looking forward to watching your show. I must tell you I'm in the second row on the 27th I think you're fine. All right. No pressure. No yeah. pressure. Yeah. Sahil Sahil what's that? You 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 I'll might get some back. high fives here. Yeah. I will definitely be doing high fives. You watch that. <laughs> Raghav. Yes sir. Raghav. Are baba Sahil bolie se hai aap. Mast ho sir aap kaise ho? ठीक ठीक देखो लेट मी टेल दी ऑडियंस अबाउट दिस लवली जेंटलमैन हु इज ट्राइंग टू बी राघव हु इज रियली साहिल मायंकर ए सुपर स्टार एंड एक्टर ए डांसर दैट हैज स्प्रेड हिज करियर ओवर द लास्ट 15 इयर्स एंड हैज सीन कोरियोग्राफी ऑन नच बलिए ऑन झलक दिखा जा यू नो व्हाट आई हैव समथिंग फॉर यू यू आर अ वंडरफुल पर्सन हाउएवर राजीव जी आपके हाथ ऐसे ही रखना प्लीज ऐसे ही है आप पूछो जो पूछ रहे हैं आप आप इसको हंसाना सिखाओ अच्छी तरह से चेहरे देखो सबके मैं सीरियस रहता हूँ बाकी सब हंसते वॉट वॉज द लास्ट दैट यू वॉन्टेड फ्रॉम साहिल फॉर दी ऑडियंस <laughs> I so I wanted a specific kind of a laughter from me. Acha. <laughs> okay and uh, the laughter was like <laughs> no it wasn't even this. It was you still not ready. So this have a show of this so this kept happening so this kept happening and for me I like I am used to say repeating things again and again so I attempt on reusing on the spot. So I went on like <laughs> <laughs> and that moment everyone was like ha 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 i'm looking at what's going on so if this laughter coming up in beyond bollywood am i able to hear it on the 27th yes of course yes you loud and clear ha to aapko yaad rakhenge us samay mujhe bhi yaad karna ki ye cartoon mila tha mujhe zoom pe aur mujhe bhi hasa raha tha so we'll be thinking of you on the 27th what is your special moment with beyond bollywood uh ha huh? i'll say there are a lot of special moments because uh, for raghav as a character there are different scenes and different uh, personalities that he portrays and he shows so not just one uh, specific scene as such all scenes are very special for me there's, there's one special scene which i love which was my audition scene is uh, it's between me and uh, shaili you have to watch it i won't tell you about the scene but that's my favorite scene after the song oh. bismillah how will i know that's your favorite scene it's this 
because it's after the song Bismillah. Okay, because on the stage you won't say, "Hey, Lalit, this is my favorite song." <laughs> <laughs> so How do you I get to know that? Enjoy the song Bismillah. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. Meena ji is actually flying in from Nakuru, from Kenya, to watch this show with me. Oh wow! Wow, that's so, nice. Rajiv ji, this this uh, aapka ye beyond Bollywood, Kenya tak pounch gaya hai. Why is she taking so much trouble? She should invite us there. <laughs> <laughs> we will come and perform for her. Pehle ek baar aake, ek baar aake thoda masala taste kar le ki ye beyond Bollywood kaisa hai. फिर वहां जाके तड़का देंगे उन नकुरु कैनियंस को साहब वन मैसेज वन मैसेज टू दी ग्लोबल ऑडियंस दैट वी हैव राइट नाउ व्हाई शुड दे कम एंड वॉच यू परफॉर्म ऑन बी ऑन बॉलीवुड सोहम यू डोंट सी एनीथिंग उटेडिकली So, if you want to have a blast and just enjoy yourselves being in that Indian culture, it's an experience more than a visual. So, I think that's yes. the reason why the global audience should come. Sudeep has something to say. No, Ballu, no. Ballu has something to say. Ballu, to Hyderabad me jalsa kar raha tha. Jab phone pe baat karta hu, ke abhi karta hu phone me Hyderabad me hu. Yeah, ye ghumta hai. Hey? ये ये घूमता रहता है ये रिहर्सल में भी फोन में रहता है टाइम तो मैं यही पूछ रहा हूँ आपको राजीव जी ये घूमता रहता है या रिहर्सल करता है या क्या करता है ये जी आई एम कमिंग टू यू जस्ट इन अफ मिनट्स आई एम कमिंग टू यू पूजा जी आई एम कमिंग टू यू टू इन जस्ट अफ मिनट्स बट वाई यू गिवन एस दी आंसर let me tell the audience who pooja pant is she is the first indian classical dancer to have performed at the lawrence oliver awards in london ladies and gentlemen we have a super kathak dancer with us a mostly kathak and a recipient of national and international awards pooja ji tell us about beyond bollywood beyond what you just told us thank you thank you um i feel um, proud and very very happy to share that i i am the first cast of beyond bollywood which happened in 2009 so i know rajiv since 2009 and rajiv had had this vision for uh, this character ma you know you see all of us have seen dil to pagal hai we know how shahrukh khan wanted to smile <laughs> Rajiv cut the ya yeah from it and said, "I want the ma." Wow! Yeah. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> and we all, he had envisioned it even before he made the show. And we uh, we happened to um, meet on a video shoot, and that's when he said that whenever I'm going to make this show, I'm definitely going to call you. And he kept his word, and I'm very very thankful and grateful to him for have chosen me for this. And since then, it's been a really long journey with him. He's more like a friend now and i have enjoyed when he says that there is a beyond bollywood show i said cancel all the dates it's got it so rajiv ji sahil alexandra yeah. hold his hands tight don't let him move <laughs> pooja you have just said pooja ji you have just said that you worked with him the longest yeah <laughs> yeah now tell us the not so good things about him come on <laughs> 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 ऐसा नहीं वॉट इज नॉट सो सो उनके कान बंद कर दो और साहिल जस्ट टेल अस टेल अस टेल अस व्हाट आर हिज वॉइस ऑन अ पब्लिक प्लेटफॉर्म ऑफ कोर्स वी नीड टू हियर अबाउट इट नो टू बी वेरी ऑनेस्ट देयर इज नॉट एनीथिंग व्हिच इज नॉट गुड अबाउट हिम बिकॉज़ ही इज नॉट जस्ट अ डायरेक्टर ही झूठ मत बोलो झूठ मत बोलो Rajiv, <laughs> ask him. But I'll tell you something. Ask him. Uh, it's true. Our friendship with Rajiv goes beyond just an actor-director relationship because we've stayed together, we've worked together, so we know each other as people. 
and i tell you beyond this mask of the director and the artist there is a beautiful human being yes. uh, inside uh, him yeah. and that is i think the biggest uh, yeah, the loving part of it <laughs> अभी अभी देखो बल्लू के नोज पे रेड नोज हो रहा है बढ़ रहा है और और राजीव जी क्लाउड नाइन पे चढ़ रहे हैं ये कल सब हॉलीडे मांगने वाले तो ये समझ रहा ऑलरेडी टू डेज गॉड ओके पूजा जी इट्स गोइंग टू बी अवर प्लेजर टू कम एंड वॉच सच एन इंटरनेशनल कैलिबर डांसर लाइक योर सेल्फ सो बियॉन्ड बॉलीवुड इज गोइंग टू रॉक under your feet london is going to be dhamakedar so we are just waiting to see all of you sahil alicia uh, pooja ji it's going to be an amazing show and i know that and that's what we are waiting to see now 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 i have got to move to these other three lovely characters yeah, let's go wo piche ladka khada hai uska thoda problem hai gungat laga lo soham ji Absolutely, absolutely. Hello, doctor. How are you? How are you? I am very good. Rajiv ji, my first encounter with this character was in Umrao Jan. Yes. Ah, uh, must be. Wazir ban ke aa gaya tha, aur fir kya kuch kar raha tha? First entry on the stage, and we see this character. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Lovely character. The Soham has been a wonderful person. We've kept in touch a little bit because he's too busy to write to me. See, so he said. <laughs> That's not true. I know whom to contact when I have to crack my bones. <laughs> At least you know that. That's the main yes. thing. Let us tell about tell the audience about this wonderful person, Soham. Soham actually is called Dingli. Did you know that? Dingli. Thank you, Goran. <laughs> Thank you very much. Abhi, <laughs> the performers know that his nickname is Dingli. Yeah. Dingli has performed. So Ham has performed in, <laughs> in over 250 shows globally, and in Umrao Jan is when I connected with him. He's performed as the lead in Namaste India, a dance musical in Knoxville, Tennessee, in the United States of America. Tom and Jerry ka bandhan hai in dono bhai beno ka. The lady sitting next to her is Goral. Hi guys. Yeah, these guys have a Tom and Jerry relationship. Absolutely. हर वक्त लड़ते रहते हैं. राजीव जी, ऐसा होता है stage stage पे, sets पे होता है ऐसा? हाँ, ये बहुत बार होता है और ये natural भी होता है. लोगों को लग रहा है acting कर रहे हैं, लेकिन ये natural हो जाता है. मेरा काम बन जाता है. Yeah, method acting हो जाती है. So हम You are playing various characters in Beyond Bollywood, from what I understand. Time he is playing various. Yes? yes. So tell me, tell me your passion. What's your passion about being in Beyond Bollywood? So Beyond Bollywood, I I think everything about the show is this. This show is actually made with a lot of passion as well. Yes. So this this show shouts passion. So you are what you attract, and that's exactly what is what has attracted me to the show. um every every minute every second on stage uh the off stage and on stage everything is so magical in the people over here it's it's just beautiful i i love every minute which i spend on stage and off stage and especially uh the captain of the ship right here mr goswami uh, he doesn't uh, as as we rightly said um behind this mask of a director he's a wonderful human and doesn't make you feel like you know he's a director and and a, a boss it's such a beautiful relation and, and i i hope uh, it goes on for a long time why are you stabbing me i'm already i'm already fumbling but now uh, uh, but now i i got the tears rolled out i i got i got my visa so it's fine yeah we yeah. yeah. are yeah. we have not been paid yet so we are saying this from the heart absolutely <laughs> अभी देखो राजीव जी आ रहे हैं ना सच सब बाहर अब आया सच बाहर ओके बल्लू जी वीजा कैंसिल नहीं होगा आपका डोंट वरी सोहम यस द जेंटलमैन सिटिंग इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू विद अ व्हाइट टी शर्ट यस ही इज अ मसल मैन एब्सोल्युटली एब्सोल्युटली या डज ही थ्रो हिज वेट अराउंड यू गाइस यस बट इन अ वेरी गुड वे इन फैक्ट ही वाज द वन हु मोटिवेट्स अस टू जिम इन फैक्ट माय फर्स्ट जिम सेशन वाज बाय Uh, him, 
He was yeah, he's, he's privately a personal Chief. trainer for yeah, yeah. all of us. <laughs> <laughs> he'll come and he'll, he won't say anything. If you're like eating chips or if you're eating something very junky, he'll just come, he'll look at you in a judgy way. Very nice. And then, <laughs> and then you have to understand, no, we have to eat a kela or perhaps an orange. <laughs> yeah. Because after all, you've got to show yourself because you are his face on stage. Yeah. yeah. Yes. And, so and, and you are you are Sahil, his six pack on the yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes, totally. Yeah. Start from here. <laughs> <laughs> wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. I mean, ask him to eat, eat more, eat more, put on weight. Yeah. So Soham is six pack or family pack? Family. I am actually uh, no pack. No. <laughs> no Sahil, six pack or family pack? Six, six. Six pack. Ah. Yeah. 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 Yes, Aray. yes. Both clearly we can ah. <laughs> As I said, I'm on the second row, yeah? So I'll be watching yeah. you. Yeah, yeah, you will probably get a 3D view of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no, I love uh, that. <laughs> <laughs> but the best part would be, so I, I, Sahil, I know you're probably going to paint yourself on the six-pack, aren't you? Uh, sorry, could you please repeat that? You will define your six-pack very nicely with some makeup. No, no, no. Natural. Otherwise, you'll sweat some more. No, uh, way. yeah. Then it'll look like a family it's family. not. It's not a movie, mind you. It's a live show. You, 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 yeah. By then he would probably be sweating anyway, so it will yeah, be a live show. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> Wonderful, yeah. Um, Soham. Coming back to you. Yes. So what is this sleeping with your eyes open? <laughs> oh God. Okay, guys. Uh, thank you very much. I'm done. <laughs> Yeah, so I, I have no idea why where this came up from, and uh, it's it's pretty really unfortunate that yes, I do sleep with my eyes open. <laughs> and I've also heard, I've also heard, that your cheek, your sneeze, is like creating a dhamaka on Beyond Bollywood. Is that correct? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it happens because of uh, what happens. Is actually, I'm helping out. So when there are te technical glitches and the sound goes off, my sneeze is what helps, and the dhamaka. <laughs> Is where it comes from. So namaste. <laughs> <laughs> this is this, this is, is actually, actually I said it's real. Everything is yeah, real. Yeah, it's this is character. Uh -huh. candid. Yeah, nobody acts in my play. They are all, <laughs> <It's> all candid. <laughs> <laughs> so my next question. This this see. I want to tell the audience that this is such a hilarious show. Look at the characters on stage today or behind stage today on Zoom. They're such a bunch of laughter. That is what Beyond Bollywood is going to create in everybody's heart. Create a lot of laughter. Vatan ki yaad dilayega. Hum koi India vapas le jayega. Peacock theater ki seat pe bethe, bethe, bethe. India ka folk dance, India ka dance, India ka music, India ke actors. Sab ko dekhenge. Everybody has to come in to Peacock theater. Now, now, now. Goral Kajal Bhai. <laughs> Does everybody know that she has a name, Kajal Bhai? No, no. no. But now that you tell us, it yeah. makes sense. Yeah. I'm going to let you guys into a secret. This oh. lovely Goral, this lovely Goral who comes as what? As Emma. Yes. Lovely. Now this Emma, let me tell you guys, is a coffee addict. Okay. Yes. Patani Starbucks hai ya Costa hai ya Raste wali coffee hai. Wo mujhe nahi malo. <laughs> coffee addict hai. So this lady has a wardrobe. Aha, dekho, uska sir aise ho gaya. Can we not talk about it, please? <laughs> Soham, thanks to you. This lady shares a wardrobe <laughs> of yes, lovely masculine clothes. Is that correct? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I cannot wear like female tops and dresses. That's not my style. I like wearing men's clothes more. I go and shop from men's section as well because I feel that's more comfortable and better. And in fact, today I was wearing Sohan sweatshirt. It's more comfortable and yeah. cool. And so 70% of our nice. wardrobe is of guys and the rest 30% is mine. Baba, I had to say that 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 I had to say that
आपका वेरियस कैरेक्टर है बियॉन्ड बॉलीवुड में इसमें मेरा कैरेक्टर रहने का सो एमा यस गोरल लवली पार्टिसिपेशन सो आर वी गोइंग टू सी यू ऑन मैस्किल इन क्लोज ऑन बियॉन्ड बॉलीवुड और आर यू फ्लैशिंग फ्रॉम बॉलीवुड दैट यू हैव टू कम एंड वॉच एक्चुअली आई कांट शेयर माय सीक्रेट्स राइट नाउ अरे बाबा सो लीव अस इन सस्पेंस You know, ladies and gents, this is one of those ladies who's acted in Rashmi Rocket in 2021. She is the best Garba queen at Palguni Patak's Garba dance. A very talented lady, a very talented lady coming on beyond Bollywood. And you know, we know Mr. Goswami doesn't take any era gera, nathu gera in his shows. He takes the cream de la cream. Yeah. So he's bringing in this wonderful team to go and watch beyond Bollywood. Goral. Tell us one point that you want to share with the audience why the audience should come and watch Beyond Bollywood. Uh, firstly, hi everybody. Uh, what I want to say is uh, this entire thing feels like home. You know, when we come for rehearsal, it doesn't feel like we're rehearsing, rehearsing. Like you know, of course there's sweat and blood and bruises and all of that a little bit, but otherwise it's like you know you come into your comfort space and safe space and. talking to everybody on and off is so much fun like together so i'm sure that is converted on stage and that will be uh, put across to the audience that they'll be able to see the chemistry that all of us share like during rehearsal and on stage with everybody it is amazing so far like we this is a new cast and we just you know we're trying to get to know each other but it's so comfortable that it doesn't feel like we're meeting for the first time as well so i think that is what the audience will also be able to see very clearly and Uh, I'm looking forward to performing, and I'm very excited. And all well, thanks to Rajiv sir because he gave us all the opportunity to be a part of it. I've been with him since 2013, and as in my first show as a dancer, then an assistant choreographer, and then I became an actor. So I have grown in beyond Bollywood, and it has been an amazing journey. So uh, otherwise, what the audience will be able to see is when you have to come and see it, and then it will be fun. Thanks. Ah, what will happen? So after. <laughs> <laughs> वो तड़का आप उस दिन लगाना ट्वेंटी सेवेंथ को कि पूरा पीकॉक थिएटर पूरा पीकॉक थिएटर तड़का लगने लगे उनको वंडरफुल सो गोर डू यू वॉन्ट यू टेल मी वन थिंग अबाउट द जेंटलमैन सिटिंग इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू विद द ब्लू टी शर्ट दिस लवली साहब वन थिंग Yes, of course. So um, I have known Sahil uh, before the show, but we have met through like in other shows and in other work forms. And he has this massive, amazing energy, and the most hardworking person I've seen. Like he told you about the laughter thing. Like he will, you know, do it as much, practice as much as he can to get it right at that point. That's one thing I really love about him. That you know, he will be there to do that at that point. The most hardworking person I've seen, even with dancing, he might get a few injuries, but he will not stop. He will continue and be doing it again and again, and very inspirational that way. So a perfectionist. Pooja ji, ab aapki baari aa gayi. Pooja ji, as we said, is an international Kathak dancer and award winner, national and international. And we are going to get a chance to watch her footsteps on the stage of Peacock Theatre. and you know what sometimes i look at this kathak dancers i really don't know whether your foot is on the floor or in the air ye to bas aise hi ghum rahe ghungru ki awaaz aa rahi yeah so tell us tell us your passion about beyond bollywood you've been working longest with this lovely gentleman uh, rajiv ji tell us tell us your experience with beyond bollywood and why should we come watch beyond bollywood on on in, in august when you guys come here yeah so uh my personal experience is that beyond bollywood challenges the actors and the dancers absolutely to to the last minute you know it, it makes you fall and then makes you get up again that's that's the beauty of this team is because it will crush your ego it will crush everything down and then make you so pure in your form for performing that you will be all out there there to enjoy and perform for the audience are wow. wah <laughs> But uh, that's what Rajiv makes sure because he he keeps rehearsals very focused, and uh, he gives uh, 
he he is a he is i think uh, an ardent lover of dance and he's himself an amazing dancer you have to watch him yeah, yeah. he is yeah. an yeah. amazing dancer i think it's complex scientific yeah. 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 i think it's i think it's a compliment but genuinely and um, he is a lover of kathak it is something which i have always yes. uh, noticed and um, he will make sure that dancers do not do anything that is non for non kathaki in their form even if they are not completely trained in it but he he will make sure that he they rehearse at least for two months for maybe a two minute sequence because kathak takes time it does take time to be done <laughs> so yeah <laughs> So we so hang on, hang on, Pooja ji. This is Kathak. No. No, that is Bharatanatyam. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Go ahead. Share, share. <laughs> so yeah. You've just so, been Pooja five. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm enrolling in Pooja Pan Dance Academy. <laughs> yeah. So that is what. And uh, the other thing is that. he he also makes sure that your uh, your dance form doesn't intermingle i mean it doesn't become um, lucid it has to be very focused and it has to be but if you are doing a garba you should look like a garba dancer if you are doing kathak you should look like a kathak dancer and that is where he maintains the sanctity which is why the the uh, the show looks so beautiful because there is variety and it has its authenticity in this so i think that is what the audience also will really enjoy because there's no mixture here. Wonderful. बिल्कुल <laughs> No. no. <laughs> He just came to explain to me the level that I needed to reach in order to perform on stage um, and to paint a clear picture of what was needed for this performance. Um especially dancing next to such an incredible conductor. Yeah, dancer. she has a competition there right on stage. Stuff. So for me it's important it was very important to have that um pressure in terms of right and I, I need to actually train properly yeah. to do this. So yeah, it wasn't it. in a bad way or anything. It was as a director, you need to do that, no? You need to do okay. that. <laughs> <laughs> Because Alexander, the reason why I ask is, was it politely saying it in a nice tone? I'm always polite. I'm always polite. Always. <laughs> yes. Okay. Last question for Pooja ji. Chief. You said if you're dancing Kathak, you dance Kathak. If you're dancing folk, you do folk. That's how it should look. So is Goral looking Goral on the stage or is Goral looking Kajal Bai on the stage? No, on stage. No. Okay. Thank you. I I want to answer that Goral is a fantastic dancer. But so you should watch her dance, Bimba. She is crazy, but she has picked up the other style also very very. Like I've seen her doing. Wow. <laughs> we look forward to that we absolutely look forward to that my ballu ji ab aapki bari aa gayi aap ghumte raho hyderabad aur fir last mein aa gaye dekho kya kare hum so ballu sudeep modak ji a lovely character in beyond bollywood a personality who started acting at the age of sirf 10 saal only 10 years old started mm-hmm. acting No wonder your mom and dad sent you to an acting school, eh? <laughs> Sudeep has been creating uh, an impact with his performances on TV shows like Crime Patrol, Pyar Tu Ne Kya Kiya, She season uh, on season two on Netflix. He has been nominated for the Best Director on at Maharashtra State Awards. A lovely personality, Baluji. Tell us about your experience with Beyond Bollywood. So. Uh... 
Well, what can I say after everybody said so much? अरे आप आपका मरी मसाला डाल दो कोई बात नहीं किसी का उधार लेने की कोई जरूरत नहीं आपका खुद का डालो तो आई एल टेल यू समथिंग आई थिंक आई हैव एक्टेड इन क्वाइट फ्यू प्लेस द लास्ट फिफ्टीन इयर्स different plays have different experiences sometimes you know you're working with certain directors who are considering it as a craft as a project sometimes the idea is to make money out of it sometimes the idea is to you know get something else out of it uh this particular play the way uh, rajiv approached it right in the beginning 10 years ago was that it's not a play it's not a project it's not a piece of work it's a dream because that was the first musical that he uh, made he's made a couple of other brilliant musicals after that he's gotten I, I mean, you know really good with the with the work that he's doing but i think this uh, there's always something special about the first work yeah because uh, you know it comes straight from the heart so i think that's what uh, you know you should you should come to enjoy the dream absolutely and we are coming and we are encouraging the audience of london and uh, surrounding london i would also say look if people can fly from kenya to watch beyond bollywood Uh, come on facebook global audience on instagram on facebook on zoom you can do the same yeah. as long as you are flying into london to rock the peacock theater with these wonderful stars we are going to have a ball of a time aren't we yes, yes. 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 so guys log on to peacock theater book your tickets now you wonderful people you wonderful souls sitting in this blue t-shirts with a family pack a six pack a splat stomach or whatever <laughs> you know you guys are awesome ya yeah, kajal bhai ho ya yeah, goril ho thank you so much thank you sabke sath it has been an amazing time with you guys on the zoom session with you we are truly excited the london audience is truly excited in welcoming you guys to peacock theater and we will be rocking at peacock theater tapping our feet looking for a six pack looking for a flat stomach looking for a family pack yeah whatever it is guys we are looking forward to this so thank you so much for this session thank you thank you thank you hang around don't run away we are going to put rajiv ji on spot right now you guys are not going to help him muh pe zip nala kuch mat bolna अभी राजीव जी का रैपिड फायर राउंड आने वाला राजीव जी आर यू ओके विद दैट यू डोंट हैव अ चॉइस आपने हाँ बोल देखो बल्लू जी आपने बोला कि बिहाइंड दिस डायरेक्टर कोरियोग्राफर राइटर इज अ लवली ह्यूमन बीइंग यू नो व्हाट आई नो दिस जेंटलमैन फ्रॉम अ वेरी डिफरेंट परस्पेक्टिव for me to be talking to him like this <laughs> as a friend is is a very interesting way of doing it because i've never done that to him i've always looked at him in awe and reverence so thank you guys you guys have made my life a lot easy for me rajiv ji thank you for giving me that permission to do so now i've got to put you on spot like you put me on spot when you taught me a course over 10 years ago ah okay aapko yaad hai ah Yeah, yeah. This is the rapid fire round on the Ninla Zoom session with Mr. Rajiv Goswami. Are we ready? <laughs> I mean, I can get some help. <laughs> no, I'm not. Of course, not. Zip, zip, zip. <laughs> nobody helps. If you help, then I will create havoc on the twenty seventh on the stage. <laughs> Pressure. <laughs> Pressure. Okay, uh, guys. Mina Ben are we ready to hear Rajiv ji's answers Absolutely wonderful dekho the first question for you Mr Rajiv Goswami on the Minlazum session a very quick question very quick answer yeah isme time nahi lena hai bahut Acha first question what does the word shoot out at Lokanwala mean to you My first independent uh, movie as a creator Brilliant second one Bollywood uh <clears throat> Artistic fusion masala curry, Indian curry. <laughs> Artistic fusion masala curry. Pooja, I have to say this. When I asked him Bollywood, unka ye ho gaya. <laughs> Artistic fusion Bollywood curry. देखो बहुत अच्छा. Okay, third one. The city of London. Um, second home. Your heart. <laughs> Good one. 
number four, your favorite Bollywood actor? Amitabh Bachchan, no doubt. Rajiv ji, who inspires you? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, I, I can say there are many things, many people, uh, but I think my own journey in, in this entertainment field, 25 years, uh, I think that's the source of sometimes uh, certain acts, certain people, certain stylists, everybody, everything inspires me. Wonderful. So, that's a hum humble soul there. Okay, the next one. What is the secret behind your abundant energy that you have? The love and support and trust of uh, people, my family, my friends, my colleagues, my crew, everybody that keeps me going. And the Zoom host. The Zoom host. <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course. Okay. Rajiv Ji, you. What eh? no. did I said family. Achha. Thank you. <laughs> okay. From a friend to a family member. I'll remember that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You live in Mumbai. So, what do you like the most? Vada Pao, Dabeli, ya fir Gold Gappe Pani Puri? Pani Puri! <laughs> okay, that's very nice. Okay, one statement, a short statement on COVID-19 pandemic. It was very tragic, very unfortunate. Uh, lives lost, uh, careers lost, business lost, 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 lost. It was very tragic and it should never happen again. It was very scary. Thank you. One city or a venue where you would like beyond Bo Bollywood, your musical to be played? Guys, Broadway? Yes. No? Yes. yes. When you play on Broadway, you're taking me as a host. Thank you. <laughs> the one favorite song of Lata Mangeshkar? Rasme ul fat ko nibhaye to nibhaye Are Baba. Love, love. Rajiv ji, your ultimate goal? Uh, to keep exploring uh, global art, talent, uh, Indian art, Indian talent, and creating uh, and working with these uh, magical cast and crew and entertaining people worldwide. Soham ka job ka pakka hai lifetime. Don't worry, Soham. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorted. Pension leram along. Okay. From the all-time Bollywood actors. What did you say? I was going to take a pension. 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 It's going to be a pension. It's going to Okay. Uh, Rajiv ji. From the all-time Bollywood actors. Your favorite. Dev Anand. Rajendra Kumar. Yeah, Firoz Khan. Firoz Khan, very stylish. Brilliant. Your favorite holiday destination? Vegas. Vegas, me kya karna jana hai? All in. Aap chaliye na saath. Aap hum bata do. Abhi aapka ek question hai. Experience. Chalenge, chalenge saath. London, Bollywood, beyond Bollywood tour ke baad. In logo ko Mumbai bhej denge, hum log Vegas jayenge. Hum log Vegas chale jayenge. Sahi hai, sahi hai. Chai ya coffee? Chai. Starbucks ya Costa? Dono se koi bhi Cutting chai. Cutting chai. Way the Indian way. Absolutely. Rajiv ji, your favorite cuisine? Uh, mom's idli sambar. Acha. <laughs> Who do you listen to? Or do you listen to any motivational speaker? And if you do, who is the one person that comes to your mind? Sadhguru. Sadhguru. One place you visit for sure whenever you come to London? Uh, actually, two. One is central London, West End, of course, and Bitta Village for <laughs> shopping. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going, we're going to central London together. Okay. Most of that. Yes. Rajiv Ji, a couple more questions. Who is God for you? God a short statement. Is, uh, pure and non dual Lord Shiva. Shadadvaita Brahmavan. Parabrahma to Krishna. 
Yeah, absolutely. The last but not the least question, social media. One short statement on social media. It's going to be the shortest. I'm still learning. <laughs> <laughs> and last but not the least, Dr. Lalit Soda's rapid fire round. Guys, load it. Load it. Load it. Oh, guns blazing. Yeah. Exciting. Rapid and fire. Yeah, it was really rapid. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Rajiv Ji. Thank you very much for participating on the Minla Zoom session round. Ladies and gentlemen, we want to thank these awesome people who have rocked the virtual platform today. We want to thank them because they are coming to London to Peacock Theatre to make us remind us of our Indian folk culture, hip hop, the dance, the music and the wonderful people. Go book your tickets at the Peacock Theatre. Rajiv Ji, a massive thank you to you, to all the actors, actresses, Sahil, Goral, Soham, Pooja Ji, Ballu, and nonetheless, Alexandra, the Spanish-Irish Bollywood mixture. We're looking forward to seeing you. Rajiv Ji, I also want to thank your wonderful person, Sushmit Bahuguna, who's yes, been yes. a wonderful help uh, assisting me through all the sessions that we have done. Yes. <clears throat> We've had this golden opportunity to witness you guys virtually. We want to come and see you physically. I truly am excited about coming to Beyond Bollywood and meeting each one of you personally and get some fun time together. Definitely. Thank you very much. And I will now open it up to Meena Ben. And Meena Ben can say a final word of thanks to all of you. Guys. Rocking you guys, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Lalit. There you are, Meena Ben. Um, we're going to unmute everybody, whoever are logged in, so they can communicate with you. Before you, before you do that, Meena Ben, your vote of thanks. Yes, yes, I know. No, I said I before. before I must tell them before they disappear. That's correct. <laughs> Havaria Zoni. Good evening. Global Namaskar to everybody. This is my pleasant and humble duty to end this session with the heartiest thank you to Mr. Rajiv Goswamiji and your Bollywood team. Thank you all. So, Beautiful souls. A Sandy Sana to all the viewers on Facebook Live and those who have logged live on this Zoom session. Can't end my thank you without saying big thank you to my cute cousin, Dr. Lalit Soda. Oh. Oh. And your co-host, Ellie. Ellie Bai. Uh, he is a student. Maybe he will come and uh, be a chapter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you all. Asandi Sana again. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Here we go, going to go offline for a while. And before, then... before you go, before you go, Mina Ben, don't unmute. Guys, I forgot one thing. All the blue t-shirt actors and actresses, I want one word from you for your superstar sitting in front of you, Mr. Rajiv. Sahil, one word for Mr. Rajiv. Hello, hello. Tick, 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 tick. One word is very difficult. But yeah, he's a, I'll say a dream one catcher. Word. One word. Bolo. 